the PlayStation 5 allows you to copy and save your games, app data, save files, media and settings onto a USB storage such as a flash drive, SSD or hard drive, which you can later use as a backup or a restore point, or to transfer your game saves to another console. So let's jump right in. First, you need to have your flash drive or any other storage connected to your PlayStation. You can either use its USB port or the Type-C port for this process. We are using a flash drive, so let's connect it via its Type-C interface, so that we can get a faster transfer speed. Then we need to go to settings, and from there go to system, now go right on system software, and then go to the option called backup and restore. We need to select backup your PS5, this will take a bit of time to load all your data, and when it's done, just select the ones that you want to backup or copy to your USB drive or storage drive. In our case, we don't want to backup all our games, so we'll just uncheck the big one and then confirm it. If you're planning on backing up and restoring games too, then you should opt in for hard drives or SSDs. When you have selected all the data you want to transfer, go to the right and select next. You can rename the backup so that you can identify it easily later. We'll keep it as it is and then select backup. Next, your console will restart. Now you can see that the backup has started. During this process, don't turn off your PS5. Let it back up and you need to turn on your controller by pressing the PS button. Now you can see our backup is complete. Hit OK and your PlayStation will restart once more. Then you can take out your USB drive and use it to restore your PS5 game saves, settings and data when needed. So you can also view it by going to settings again. From there go to system, then backup and restore. Now if we select restore your PS5, you'll see that the flash drive we have selected as backup will pop up here. So you just need to select it and hit restore. So that's how simply you can copy PS5 game saves and console data to a USB storage. Hope this was helpful. Feel free to leave your feedback and I'll see you around.